I particularly, the part I'm going to keep and use the Archbishop, is your presentation on the outlook, values, and approaches young people we send off to universities. It was a very, it was just an excellent description. Um, Father John and Melanie, you use some of that material. Now, I particularly like the MTDs. You know, the MTDs, this is Christian Smith's moralistic, therapeutic deism. You know, they, you kind of keep religion around in case you get in a pickle. And you say a little prayer. Of course, God loves you no matter what you do, right? And if you felt like it, that's a little bit of nihilism there. You, well, I felt like it was okay, President Elsner, but I said, well you got to form your feelings a little better. We call that a conscience. Okay. I feel like it's okay to be all night, male and females in rooms. I talk about near occasion of sin. Some of the students hadn't heard about it. I don't have to argue that point too much. They know how I feel. We made the decision. We don't do that kind of thing. But the MTDs, oh, well, you have the other. But I would also tell you this, and, and some of you are very involved in Catholic schools. I don't have all the research and data, but I have some good data points. We have 37 seminarians, a hundred and some what we call San Damiano scholars at our campus that are integrating, they want to become theologically competent, and they are involved in service in the church, and they're going to serve the church, that's their goal. Young people with a strong background, many of them Catholic school backgrounds, you can almost pick them out that are at daily mass and weekend mass and are serving at the campus level at Marion University. You get to talking to them and I'll say, where did you go to high school? And it's a saint or a bishop something almost invariably. The work is so very clear to me, the benefits and the fruit of our work in these K-12 schools, it screams at me every day to double down on the investment 